What's up, YouTube Slims? It's your boy Cosmo here. I didn't mess up the first video, so I'm kind of remaking it. And I wanted just to say, I seen you guys saying but you like my last video on, you know, the, the controller setup for Arma 3. And somebody had a good recommendation. Um, his name is Whale5 or Whale V. He said to go ahead and do uh, an addition for Arma 3. So, I mean, I'm sorry, not Arma, but Daisy. And so first off, once you start off by going ahead and hit that big picture mode, you already know what's up. And I'm going to just show you how the controller setup is. And we can go over some little bit of things about setting it up. So first, of course, go to Daisy Manage Game Controller Configuration. And I just want to say there's one thing you'll have to change after you get the um, controller configuration. You'll have to go to your settings on Daisy go to your controls key bindings your key key bindings for your um you know your mouse and keyboard um and you want to change the button that is change stance you want to change that mouse back button which is this one um if they're beside each other it's the one on the back side not the one that's ahead so mines are beside each other it's the one on the back and not the one ahead um you would just want to go ahead and change that to that one so that way when you do go prone with the controller it doesn't you know act weird um other than that i pretty much got this controller really set up correctly for you guys you, you know it's not going to be a hassle it's almost identical literally almost exactly the same to daisy on the xbox i tried my best to make sure everything was you know a little bit different than before um the lean left it is on toggle while lean right is not so when you lean left it will just be just a click because it does also eye focus and free look which is the same as on Xbox, but the control is a little different on the Xbox for some reason. I don't know. Um, I couldn't necessarily figure it out. But everything else is the same. And I actually left the D-pad right open for you guys if you have to add anything you want. You can also modify this controller, so don't hesitate to modify it at all. Be my guest. I'm not going to see you. <laughs> Just, you know, I didn't make D-pad right anything. I didn't find a use for it. Maybe you do. Um... Well, and also when you begin, this the left trigger also aims. So when you begin to aim, it'll take you to this section of the controller now. You have your zeroing up at X, zeroing down at A. You can also change your stance again. I just, you know, drag it over, reload, and also take one out the clip. Um, I have to change fire mode here and voice chat. Also, you can change the camera, the camera angle you're in so from first to third with the right stick click. And also, you can lean left and right. You can also add two more to the right on the D-pad and up on the D-pad. If you feel the need to, then do so. Be my guest. Um, but I'll show you how to get this controller fig now. So a lot of you were a little confused about this the last time um, on how to get the controller set up. So what I do, and I'm just going to have this be the primary way, you can go to your, a person on your friends list, and you're going to send them this link. I just tell them to ignore this. You'll just simply copy it from the description i'll leave four in the description so you can't miss it just copy it paste it and send it on over i'm not going to keep spamming my friend he's going to get irritated but you just you just go on ahead and, and just send it over and he'll note he'll notice it but um you'll see it and also once you send through you just click it and you just press apply apply configuration you're good and from there you know before you hook a controller up to the game and start the game up this will already be set every time you start the game um, you can also change it and modify it how you please. It's just for your, your handiness. Um, other than that, that's all for now. I want to say thank you for giving me the opportunity to make another video for you guys. I liked you guys' feedback from the last one. And I want to keep grinding. So leave a like, subscribe, be ready for more content.